Welcome to Evolve Bow Hunting Outdoors. Today's gonna to be a good day working on the farm. We've got the big and beastie planted. We've got rows of peas planted. And I think it turned out really good. We drove over it a little bit with the four wheeler. Supposed to get some rain this afternoon and into tomorrow. So she is looking amazing. The food plot really is looking amazing. We were able to get a tractor this year with a tiller on the back of it and turned over some plow down clover. Since we got it turned over, we uh, gave the food plot a head start that it asked for, which would be green manure because the brassica loves to have nitrogen to start. So we get this rain today, which you can kind of see here, looks like it's getting ready to come. We get this rain today and the rain tomorrow and this bad boy should take off. Well, we're gonna start fencing it in now with this hot zone fence and get it all covered up. Stay with us of all bow hunting outdoors. is July 28th. Supposed to get some rain later today. We are also supposed to get some rain tomorrow. Uh, last week I turned over all the food plots. This is the ambush plot we're standing in uh, right now and uh, the three micro plots are ready to go. What Mike's doing is he's taking a hoe here and we're gonna put some peas in here. We actually got a hot zone fence this year so we're gonna fence this off in a square area. We're gonna do peas we're also going to do frigid forage, big and beastie, uh, in this ambush plot. And then we got some wall hanger to go in the three micro plots along with some more peas and stuff. But this plot here, uh, we're going to square it off. And so we'll leave a little bit exposed so we can check our browse pressure compared to the main portion, the main square of the uh, plot. So we can see, you know, when about we think would be a good time to open this plot up. So you need about 45 to 60 days for brassicas to fully mature. Uh, like I said, it is July 28th. So by the end of September, uh, which would be the start of Ohio's season, uh, archery season, it should be fully matured. And then we need that very first frost to help with the big beastie to turn it into sugar. Uh, so the deer will eat on it more. So Mike's making some rows of these peas because we saw and found out last year these uh, deer absolutely love peas um, but we didn't have it fenced off and they ate it right to the dirt before the season even opened so we're gonna be able to check this out stay with us of all bow hunting outdoors today's gonna be a good day working on the farm 